voice over time okay so here she starts off with a cleanser to clean the outside world off my face i didn't have any makeup on but it's just got cream and outside world on it so goodbye okay so what she does next is she applies um, a Dermalogica product, can't remember which one, and this goes hand in hand with the Oxygeno machine and it helps exfoliate, open the pores so that the Oxygeno machine can do its bit and help get those bacterias and nasties off your skin. Okay, so the machine doesn't hurt that much, it more like bubbles and fizzes on your face because it's kind of got a microdermabrasion ending it kind of feels uncomfortable on the forehead because you've got so thin skin there you know and it's near the bone but in general it doesn't really hurt um and she does change the ends of that so you don't have to worry okay so i've got the extraction done that killed me and she's cleaning it all off and then she wipes it down with antibacterial wipes and then places the antibacterial on your skin to soothe it before she comes in with the high frequency machine. So the high frequency machine is fantastic because it kills the bacteria off your skin, so it works with the antibacterial wipes, but it helps sell your skin, especially after extraction and the oxygeno, and it helps calm your skin down quite a lot. Okay, now we're gonna go in with the laser, and the laser is brilliant, and you guys know it's brilliant. I have a full video on the laser, so I'll link that below. That's why this clip is super short, because you've seen it before. Okie dokie, this machine is hilarious. It was giving me static electric shots on my fillings because my fillings are metal and for some reason it was reacting weird. So she lowered the frequency and it was totally fine and this firms and lifts the skin. Good morning. Okay, so guys, it's been four weeks since my Oxygeno and my laser. Okay, it was my third round and I had a lot of people commenting, oh, I can't see much difference and it was because I was uploading videos a week after the treatment when it had settled but you can't see the most results until the third and fourth week. So I'm going to show you my skin three, four weeks later. I am in Korea now. I wanted to do an apartment tour. So stay tuned, stop looking, stop looking behind me. Um, okay, so I'm, I've got like a little window area, so I'm trying to get natural lighting because I don't have lighting, I don't have a tripod. Girls and guys, that's what I need to buy, okay? Um, I've not even brushed my teeth this morning. I just wanted to show you my face with the scarring. I really feel the indentations have gone. I still have a little bit of pigmentation, but they have shrunk, so I've got red dots everywhere. But it's not live acne. It's not anything um, to worry about, to be honest. It will go eventually, and I'm gonna still derma roll while I'm here. But I've just been taking a break for three months so I could solely see how the laser and the Oxygeno would work without derma rolling. So I am going to get back to it. It's not like I don't derma roll. It was just that three month break while I trial and error the laser. Okay, let's look at my face now. Okay, so can you see the indentations have reduced rapidly? You could literally see craters in my face when the sunlight was on it. Like I said, pigmentation's still there. That'll go one day. But the indentations were my biggest insecurity. I think the laser has actually worked quicker than derma rolling. Um, I had a few questions. Derma rolling or laser? I think derma rolling is good for your small indentation and your pigmentation. It's great for pigmentation and very small indentation. But when you've got the deeper ice pick scars, you need something bigger and stronger so you can go for a bigger needle or you can go for laser. So I think laser for quicker results and derma rolling for maintenance. So that's my opinion on that. So guys, remember that I am doing trial and error with all these products and all these treatments. I'm not being sponsored by the Oxygeno and Laser Place. I wanted to find a solution to get rid of my scarring and my acne for good and scarring was killing me because my skin looked very clear it looked nice and smooth until i wore makeup or until i hit a certain light and angle and i was upset and i felt ugly and disgusting i'm just using trial and error to find out what works best honestly the laser has worked the best so far i'm quite happy but because i'm in korea i need to find similar laser the same laser i need to find that place here okay i've only been in my apartment for a week so i honestly have no time to find one 
yeah but when I settle I will be finding great Korean products to try out and also great Korean procedures so comment in the comment section below if you know any procedures or any Korean treatments Korean products that I should try out for my skin because I don't really know any comment below and I will trial them I'll find them and try them okay guys thank you so much for watching love you guys comment like subscribe you know the dealio hit the bell so you get notifications for every time I upload I'm getting back to that regular schedule guys and you'll get to know more about my adventures in Korea love you bye